one of the key challenges was the delivery of materials. Guernsey is a very small island. It doesn't produce sufficient quantities to deliver the project to the programme required. So we had an idea uh, to manufacture a temporary harbour facility in order to import our aggregates. That in itself secured the programme, safe timing programme, and made sure that we had no uh, logistical risk in our, our price. Lagging Construction are our uh, contractor, um, selected through a competitive uh, tendering process, a very thorough uh, competitive uh, process which included a period of uh, value engineering where Lagging were able to, uh, to bring their good ideas to, uh, to, the, uh, to the proposal. And um, the relationship has, uh, has continued to be extremely good. We have um, our regular um, daily meetings which identify exactly what's going to be going on throughout the course of both the day shift and the, and the night shift. Lag and construction drew upon our experience of working in Hong Kong, Luton Airport, Puerto Rico to ensure that we delivered a competitively tendered bid, saving the client money and delivering ahead of their, their programme schedule. The majority of the works were, were delivered in planned closures of the, of the airfield, so we, we gained possession at 9.30 at night and handed back at 5.30 in the morning. Should we have been late, there were penalties associated with flight delays and thankfully in the project we didn't have any significant delays to, to flight operations which is a testament to the expertise of the site team. against large multinational companies and we were successful in the award of the project due to our expertise, our in-house knowledge of runway resurfacing projects and the fact that we brought a lot of innovations, a lot of value engineering to the client which saved circa five million on the project value and delivered, helped deliver the project some nine months ahead of schedule.
In line with our, co our corporate social responsibilities, we recognise that the project, with the massive logistics and nighttime working, had a big impact on the local population. So we made a very early decision. We had to get heavily involved in the local communities. So some of the, the initiatives we supported was a drink driving campaign. We helped out at the local special needs school to build a garden of reflection. We sponsored numerous local charities, football teams, and we tried to be a good neighbour. We helped the local population uh, during the severe snowstorms of March 2013. We assisted with clearing off some 20,000 tonnes of, of snow from the runway in order to get the airport operational again.